So today I'm going to show you how to find the bandwidth of your LAN uh, from your local computer to the network itself. So this isn't the speed every device on your network is, but it's your negotiated speed to your network. So essentially the issue with that would be like um, you might have a router that is gigabit capable and a switch that's gigabit capable, but if all the devices on them are limited to 10 100, uh, then you don't really get the benefits of the gigabit. So this can be pretty important to figure out that uh, if you have a gigabit network card in your computer and you plug it into your router or your switch, um, you don't necessarily know if you're getting gigabit or not. So um, it, there's a pretty simple way to check. So essentially just go down to your um, network uh, little icon in the bottom right here, and then just right click on it and say open network and sharing center, and then it will have all your connections over here on the right. So this little icon indicates I'm plugged into the network, but then I'm also connected over Wi-Fi. So first I'll show you uh, my actual physical connection to the network. Uh, it says right here, speed is 100 megabits. So that means that I don't have a negotiated gigabit link to my network. And that's actually because my computer does have a gigabit card, but the router that I'm connected to, like the physical port, is only 10100. So no matter the fact that my computer can run much faster than that, the router can't. So this is good information to know if things are operating at their max speed or not. So this really means I need to upgrade the rest of my equipment because my computer can handle it, but I'm still not getting it. Um, then on the other hand, on your Wi-Fi, uh, if I click on that option here, um, it's saying speed right here is 72.2 megabits. So the two limitations with Wi-Fi are the communication type and then the actual signal strength. So when you get a router, it should say what its maximum um, bandwidth would be, and that's if you have full signal strength. So 72.2 for wireless N is for this device is essentially as high as it goes, um, but that's with full signal strength. If you see this start dropping off, then it'd probably start, it probably start saying its negotiated signal strength is only 36 or, or even way less than that. So um, that's just a good way to kind of test if you are getting your full network throughput and if you're getting what you would think you would get. Like if you bought a much faster router, but you're still getting uh, lower wireless speeds, then you might want to start investigating. So that's the easiest way to tell what your negotiated speeds are. Um, you would need to use something like iPerf, which I will show in another video to actually test what you are getting, but this is your negotiated speed.